Hello everyone! Welcome to the Reader Side. I'm Jana and I'm an avid digital reader. And since I'm new here, I'm going to participate on the Booktube Newbie tag. And I'll link on the description down below the creator of this tag. So the first question is, why did you start this Booktube channel? I started this booktube channel because ever since lockdown started, I ran out of things to do to entertain myself without leaving our house. I watch hundreds of movies, I binge watch K-dramas, I decluttered our room, I even started to learn a new instrument just like everybody else. But at the end of the day, I felt like my thirst to experience new adventures wasn't fulfilled. I was basically stuck and it stressed me out that every day felt like the same until all the days of the week lead together. I remember at one point, I was just sitting in my room daydreaming about an alternate world where it is safe to go outside without worrying for our health. But when I woke up from my daydream, I was so disappointed because I am still stuck here, bored out of my mind. Until one day, I was cleaning my phone, decluttering all my digital stuff when I came across an old application where all my downloaded books are, sto are stored back when I was still in high school. Then I remembered that back then, I was an avid reader. And since I can't go out, I figured I would try to read again. Essentially, I was only planning to read one book per month at first. But when I opened that book, it was as if I was transported to a whole new world around new people with a whole new possibility. And since then, I never had a boring day because a new day means a new book and a new book means new adventures. But after reading... Numerous books, especially good ones, I accumulated this urge to talk about the books I am currently reading. I don't know how to explain it, but I just have this feeling that I want to share the books I'm reading and explain why I love it or why I hate it. So that's why I created this channel, Reader Side, so I can have an outlet where I can talk about books and share my love of reading to the people who also love books. So for the second question, what are some fun and unique things you can bring to BookTube? Since I'm still new here, I don't really have an exact answer to that, but I do hope that you would stick around with me so we can discover unique things together. Also, I'm hoping maybe the unique thing that I can contribute to booktube is that even though I mainly read romance novels, I also venture out to other genre from time to time. I like reading fantasy even if there is no romance elements involved. I also like reading literary fiction and some science fiction from time to time. So I'm hoping that I could help romance readers try new books that are outside of their comfort zone. So the third question, what are you most excited for about this channel? I'm really excited to meet new people who also like reading because I never really had any close friends who like to read the same books that I read. So, then, so the next question, why do you love reading? I love reading because it helps me feel like I'm not alone. Growing up, we would always hop from one city to the next because of my parents' job. So I never really had that place where I feel like I belong. I don't have a lot of close friends because we would always end up moving away. So all throughout my childhood, I felt so alone, but books have always been my companion. Next question, what books or series got you into reading? I can't really remember the exact title of the book that got me into reading, but I remembered it was young adult romance that hooked me to binge read books for months. And since then, I've been reading other subgenre of romance, and now I'm branching out to other genre as well. Next, what question would you ask your favorite booktuber? So the question I would like to ask them is that, how did you stay consistent? I would really like to know. Next, what challenges do you think starting a book channel will be the hardest to overcome? I think that the hardest thing to overcome in starting this booktube channel is in speaking the English language correctly. English language is not my first language, nor is it my second one. My first language is our native tongue, and my second language is our national language. So English is my third language, and it's hard for me most of the time to speak because I'm scared that I might mess up the grammar or I might say an offensive word that I did not know is offensive. So please, 
pardon my grammar and my pronunciation but know that I'm educating myself every day with this language. Next question, when did you start reading? I started reading for fun when I was in 5th grade. Then when I turned 14, I discovered YA romance and I became obsessed with reading. But then I stopped when I went to college because I got dizzy. Next question, where do you read? I can read everywhere but I mostly read on the bed because it's comfortable. Last question, what kinds of books do you like to read? 80% of what I read are mostly romance and I do like to read different subgenres of it. I like to read contemporary romance, paranormal romance, historical romance, weird alien romance, and mafia romances. Then, the remaining 20% will depend on my mood. I sometimes read high fantasy, science fiction, literary fiction, non-fiction, and other stuff. But I don't read horror unless there's an element on it that I'm intrigued. For example, if it's a horror with a psychological mess up stuff and I'm intrigued with the psychological part of it, I might reconsider but that rarely happens. I also do not read taboo romances because it triggers my anxiety. I do read forbidden romances like for example, Insane Age Gap or Brother's Best Friend Trope but I do not like reading taboo romances like incest for example what i read so far as of now i have already read 54 books which is insane and i am excited to share them all to you in the form of recommendation videos for the next few months to come so that's it i hope you enjoy watching see you next time